Hi, welcome to India Food Network. I'm Asha Khatao. Today I want to show you nice and easy a Mediterranean dip recipe which is called Mutabal. If you like to know how to make it, keep watching. To make this uh, very easy mutabal, what we require mainly is one medium size roasted eggplant. As you can see, it is nice and charred. Uh, we also require two to three cloves of crushed garlic, one small onion finely grated, one small tomato blanched and chopped, one to two tablespoons of chopped parsley, sugar and salt to taste. We also require to put on top is the olive oil. As we begin to make uh, our uh, lovely dip called mutabal, the first most important step is here to de-skin the roasted eggplant. Usually this process is done under running water. We just hold the eggplant from the stem under running water and very gently we remove the skin. So after removing the skin, very gently I cut off the top part which either you can discard or you can just uh, keep it at the side and maybe use it as part of your garnish and then very roughly you chop this one first if the little skin part remains or it comes in your hand you can just remove it roasting this eggplant gives a very nice uh, smoky flavor to your dip and after cutting it you use a fork to mash it. Now I could do this same thing in a blender or a food processor but I prefer to do this manually because this is going to have a little texture which gives a character to your dip. You know the little wholeness of the food will show. Now one by one I'm going to start mixing all the ingredients. First goes in the crushed garlic. You have to keep mashing it with the fork so as to blend in all the ingredients nicely. Then goes in finely grated onion. Usually when you grate the onion, it gives out a lot of water. So it's a good idea to squeeze out that water so that your dip doesn't become runny. And here we continue mashing it. Now goes in some salt without which no food will taste as good. So about half to one teaspoon of salt. Mash it again. Now we add the blanched and chopped tomatoes which gives not only the lovely red color specks to the dip also tastes very tangy. Now we are ready to add some nice herbs which is gives a lovely aroma and the flavor to the dip which is finely chopped fresh parsley. If you don't get fresh parsley, it's okay if you put the dried ones which in which case you will put half the quantity. As you know, the eggplant has got slightly bitter taste naturally. So to balance out that slight bitterness, I like to add little sugar to all eggplant dishes that I make and that kind of balances out the bitterness and make eggplant taste liked more by people. So we are all set here to serve this uh, eggplant dish. I'm going to show you how to garnish it and how to serve it. So let's transfer this to a nice uh, colourful serving bowl or a plate. If you are using a bowl, make sure it is a little shallow one so that you can spread the mixture nicely and uh, garnish it on top. What I like to do is uh, over this dip, I like to make this pattern with the fork which kind of looks nice and little bit of dent in the centre where I like to add some olive oil. Also scatter a little bit of olive oil all over as well. Some more of the herbs. 
I like my eggplant to be a little bit spicy so I like to add a little bit of chili flakes as well and some olives you can use either green or the black whichever one you prefer and uh, do you remember that we saved the top of the eggplant when we were cutting it and uh, this gives a nice uh, look and little burnt skin also gives that little touch to your dip it's a good piece to garnish with and this is served with some lavash so this was our uh, plain and simple and colorful mutabal a mediterranean dip served with crisp lavash if you like this recipe subscribe to india food network and do remember to send us the feedback